Have you ever felt manipulated in a relationship? This feeling can often be traced back to a manipulative tactic known as triangulation. Picture a triangle with you, the narcissist, and an unsuspecting third party at each corner. Narcissists love this tactic because it creates drama, fuels competition, and leaves you feeling isolated and confused. The third party, they're often just as clueless as you are, manipulated into a dance they didn't sign up for. The narcissist is the puppet master, pulling the strings to create a power dynamic that leaves you vying for their approval. It's a twisted game, but one that you're not destined to play forever. By understanding and spotting these tactics, we can avoid the trap. Today we will explore 10 ways to avoid falling into this manipulation trap set by narcissists. Stick around as these strategies could be the key to reclaiming your peace and escaping the narcissist triangulation trap. Firstly, it's crucial to recognize the triangulation. This generally manifests when the narcissist deliberately creates tension or competition between you and another person. It could be through gossip, pitting you against someone else for their attention, or constructing scenarios where you're forced to defend yourself or prove your loyalty. Recognizing these situations is your first line of defense against the triangulation trap. Now, once you've identified the triangulation, the next critical step is disengagement. The narcissist thrives on the drama they create, and your participation only fuels their game. So, refuse to engage. Don't get drawn into gossip, don't compare yourself with others, and don't get involved in the conflicts they instigate. Maintain your neutrality and steer clear of taking sides. It's not about being passive, it's about being proactive in protecting your peace. Remember, not participating in the drama is a powerful move. Setting boundaries is the next crucial step. Establishing clear lines of what is and isn't acceptable behavior is a powerful tool against narcissistic manipulation. Remember, your feelings, needs, and values are valid. Make it known to the narcissist that their triangulation tactics are unacceptable and you won't engage in their drama. However, setting boundaries isn't just about what you won't accept, but also about what you want and deserve. A positive relationship, free from manipulation and power plays, is your right. This brings us to the next point, prioritizing your relationships. In the whirlwind of a narcissist's drama, it's easy to lose sight of the relationships that truly matter. Focus on the people who treat you with respect, kindness, and understanding. These are the relationships that deserve your time and energy. Nourish these bonds and you'll find a supportive network that values you for who you are. So, invest your time and energy in relationships that respect and support you. Seeking support is a sign of strength, not weakness. It's essential to surround yourself with people who respect you and validate your feelings. Friends, family, or a professional therapist can provide a safe space for you to express your experiences. They offer an outside perspective and can guide you through the process of understanding and navigating the narcissist's manipulation. Now, let's not forget about self-care. It's a crucial component in this journey. Prioritize your well-being above all else. Find activities that bring you joy and peace. Whether it's reading a book, taking a walk in nature, or practicing yoga, engage in what makes you feel good about yourself. Manage your stress effectively. Meditation, deep breathing exercises, or simply taking a quiet moment for yourself can do wonders. Remember, you're not just surviving, you are thriving. You are more than the drama and the chaos. You are worthy of respect and happiness. Remember, it's not selfish to take care of yourself. Sticking to the facts is essential. We can't emphasize this enough. In the midst of the narcissist's manipulation, it's easy to get lost in their twisted narrative. But remember, it's their game of distortion their attempt to gaslight you. So, hold on to your experiences, your observations, they are your truths. Don't let the narcissist jumble your facts or confuse your reality. Now you might feel the urge to retaliate, to seek revenge. It's a natural response when we feel wronged. But here's the thing. Attempting to one-up the narcissist or engage in their game only fuels the drama. It keeps you entangled in their toxic web. Revenge might seem satisfying in the short term, but it doesn't lead to healing or growth. So instead of focusing on getting even, focus on getting better. Invest in self-care, seek support, and work towards your own healing. 
Remember, this journey is about you, not them. Stay focused on your own healing, not on getting even. You are not to blame for the narcissist's behavior. Remember this mantra when you find yourself tangled in the web of a narcissist's triangulation. It's all too easy to shoulder the responsibility for the chaos they create, but it's crucial to understand that their actions and the resulting drama are not your fault. You are not the puppeteer in their performance. You are merely the puppet, manipulated to serve their needs. Now, let's talk about the power of intuition. It's that little voice inside, that gut feeling that nudges you when something doesn't feel right. This internal radar is your best defense against the narcissist's manipulative tactics. When something feels off, it probably is. Trust your instincts, they've been honed by human evolution to protect you from harm. So don't bear the blame for the narcissist's actions. Instead, empower yourself by trusting your intuition. Always trust your gut feeling, it's your internal radar. Freedom from manipulation is achievable. As we round up this enlightening journey, let's take a moment to reflect on the key takeaways. Recognize the signs of triangulation, and once you do, disengage from the drama. Set your boundaries firmly and prioritize your relationships. Healthy, genuine connections are the antidote to the narcissist's toxic games. Seek support from those who understand and empathize with your experiences. Remember, you're not alone in this. Focus on self-care. You're important and your well-being matters. Don't let the narcissist jumble the facts or lure you into a revenge game. You're above that. Never blame yourself for the narcissist's manipulative behavior and always trust your intuition. If something feels off, it probably is. These steps, when taken consistently, can help you free yourself from the triangulation trap. Remember, you deserve healthy relationships and a life free from manipulative drama.